Hey, it's Tori, and welcome to, or welcome back to my channel. Ivor is out here dropping brand new music. She also has a brand new album coming out soon. The single we are checking out today is called Jardartra. I probably absolutely butchered that, but I did see on her Instagram that the English translation, well, the closest we can get to it is Dust to Dust. Now, Ivor is one of those artists that I feel extremely lucky to be alive at the same time that she is on this earth, you know, her voice is so magnificent and it's just like a breath of fresh air. And I fell in love with her as I heard her on the soundscape and the storytelling throughout a TV show called The Last Kingdom. It's such a great show and then you put Ivor's voice in with the soundtrack and it just elevates it to another level. She's also one of those artists that I would absolutely love to see live. I know she's touring with Heilung and she'll be in, I think the closest she's coming to me is Washington DC, but that's like a seven, eight hour drive. So I'm really, really hoping that she's able to announce like a, a US tour, either headlining or supporting somebody else. And but I also know how difficult that is and how expensive that is and everything that goes with that. So we'll just keep our fingers crossed and, and hope for the best. But yeah, without further ado, let's just dive right in and check this song out together. What an absolutely stunning intro. As soon as Ivo's voice came in, I just had all over body goosebumps. I also really love how bassy the instrumentation is with that percussion of the drum, but then her voice just floats so effortlessly over it, and it's so incredibly stunning. It's just like art, you know? Just pure art. I love that low resonance she's giving us right now. love how raw this is and the energy that that is bringing is astounding. As I said, I love this low vocal technique she is using. It's not something we tend to hear a lot from Ivor 
And I love that she's using it here. And this music video is absolutely gorgeous too. The whole thing, the music, the voice, the music video, as I said, it's like a piece of art. It's so visually stunning, but also just listening to it, it's, it's really mind-blowing. Love the keys throughout. It's so haunting, yet ethereal at the same time. The energy it's bringing as well, it's making me feel very grounded in, in a weird way. And I love how she's singing in her native tongue, because you don't necessarily have to understand what she's saying to connect to a song. It's all about that emotion and what those emotions bring. Now this has got me wondering how this would sound live and what little nuances Ivor would add in with her vocal style because obviously during live performances uh, vocalists like to change things up just a little bit so it doesn't get boring and repetitive and they add little things here and there and I'm very curious what she would do for that. It also sounds very futuristic, but also very ancient at the same time. You know, the visuals are very in the future, but then you've got that haunting melody and the way Ivor is using that low resonance on her voice that just feel very tribalistic in a way. And it's very, it's fascinating. And it's made me so excited to hear more from the new album definite playlist song for me and hopefully one day i get to see her live i'd actually love to set up a talks with tori with her you know i think that would be fascinating just to discuss who she is and her music and her culture and everything like that 
I'm going to try and make that happen. I can't make any promises, but we'll see if we can get it done. But don't forget to like and subscribe to become a Torian. Speaking of becoming a Torian, all of my social media links and my Discord link are down in the description. We'd absolutely love to have you come hang out in the Discord community, and I will see you guys in the next video. Rock on.